When we think of heroes, we often think of outgoing individuals who receive frequent accolades for their good work, in part due to their dominant personalities. But sometimes a true hero is a quiet achiever who avoids the spotlight, and whose humility and selflessness inspires and lifts up his colleagues, students, and patients. Dr. Todd Sakakibera is a quiet hero. As a primary care physician at Vancouver Coastal Health's Three Bridges Community Health Center, Dr. Sakaki Berra has made a long-term commitment to improving health care for residents of Vancouver's inner city, a vulnerable and underserved population. Dr. Todd Sakaki Berra works here at the Three Bridges CHC and he cares for primary care and transgender patients. Todd's demeanour is gentle and compassionate and he's always patient-oriented. He operates with a large empanelment of patients but also helps here through quality improvement initiatives and by chairing and leading a number of other change management processes. His nimble, measured and innovative approach to community medicine can be seen in his leadership of the Vancouver Boost Collaborative at his clinic, which is located in an area of the city that sees the highest concentration of opioid overdose deaths. The BOOST Collaborative has made significant progress in improving access to integrated, evidence-based care for opioid users. As a result of this work, there has been a significant increase in the number of individuals who receive and remain on opioid treatment therapy. In addition to his own clinical practice, Dr. Sakaki Berra is an educator, researcher, and mentor in the areas of LGBTQ health, substance use, mental health, transgender care, and addictions. For many years, I've been participating in a UBC um, project called CHIAS, which is the Community Health Initiative by University Students. And it brings together students from different faculties of medicine, nursing, social work, pharmacy, and occupational therapy. And it's really meant to highlight the elements of working together on a team for patients who are dealing with com really complex issues like chronic pain, diabetes, and uh, issues of marginalization, oppression, and poverty. I was part of a working group that uh, was focused on trying to improve interactions with, between physicians and their gay patients. So uh, we developed a workshop called, But I Don't Have Any Gay Patients, um, and it focused on some of the health issues for gay men. And my part in it was really to um, coach and uh, teach a little bit more about how language and communication can really impact uh, how our patients respond. Um, using language can cause people to never come back again uh, or feel w welcomed and invited. I know his patients feel respected primarily. They feel empowered to be autonomous but they also feel that they can trust this doctor with some of their most um, challenging situations in their life. In 2017, he received an Award of Excellence from the Canadian College of Family Physicians, and he has received countless recognition awards from students and residents who have been inspired by his work. Dr. Sakaki Berra, for your quiet commitment to improving healthcare in vulnerable and underserved communities, and for inspiring a generation of doctors to provide better care in the areas of LGBTQ health and substance use, you have been named this year's Healthcare Hero for Vancouver Coastal Health. Generously sponsored by Pacific Blue Cross.